the adult rock hoppers attempt to defend their chicks. But beyond protesting loudly, there's little they can do. Penguins cannot fly. These inexperienced parents lost both their chicks. The pre-adult period is the most dangerous, but grown penguins face perils too. Like other seal types, southern sea lions eat mostly fish, but the occasional sea lion, always male and frequently older and socially isolated, preys upon penguins. Generally, they lie in wait near the water's edge, but this one seems very determined, pursuing the frightened birds far across the rocks. driving them off a ledge over five times their height. One after another, they make the desperate leap. It's a hard landing, but better than certain death. The penguins scatter. It's a dead end for the sea lion. But this great beast has clearly developed a taste for penguin meat. He doesn't give up. The sea lion is successful. As he heads back to the shore through the tangled kelp beds, for one more day, he has assured his own survival. Just as surely as he has guaranteed the death of a penguin chick, who will search in vain for its absent parent before inevitably dying of starvation. Hungry giant petrels gather on the water, impatient for the sea lion to rip apart the penguin so that they can scavenge its remains. An end for one penguin a beginning for others. It is all part of nature's balance. In a land where humans briefly skirmished, an age-old battle wages on. To eat, to not be eaten, to live, to survive.